Hey guys, John P from GeekBeat. Uh, today's vlog, I'm just going to show you one cool little thing that we've been playing with. Okay, so come over here to the closet. This is the control module for the Iris system. Now, Iris is the home automation system that I saw that I showed you guys when we went to uh, uh, CES this year. So. The plan is Lowe's has built the infrastructure for people to be able to uh, use their web-based interface and their iPhone app and Android app um, as long as uh, the manufacturers build in support for the Iris system. So for example, we've got a GE wireless light switch and we've installed one right here. Um, now, what GE had to do was they had to conform to whatever Lowe's API was for, for Iris. And when we installed this switch, we basically just powered on by hitting the switch. It connected to that home control device. We then went into a web interface, which I'll show you in just a second, and set it up. And now here's the result. So we've got a working switch here. This controls the production lights in there. So you'll see if I flip the switch, I'm just going to turn it off and bingo, all those lights go off, hit it again, they all come back on. So now that's great. It's just a light switch. But the cool part is now we log in here to the irissmarthome.com website. This is, um, this is just the interface when you're logged in, but you see it says control right here, and it says production area lights. I click through here, and uh, this is a little power button. So if I click it, now Dave, turn around and watch. Okay, the lights out there are off. I'm gonna click it again, and the lights turn on. So I can sit in here, and I can just mess with everybody's heads by turning them on and off uh, randomly. And I promise you, I'm doing that. No one's out there <laughs> flipping the switch. So uh, there's also things like thermostats. So I've got this thermostat in this box. <clears throat> this one is already, um, it's already got batteries in it and it's tied into the system. So you'll see if we go back over here to the home page, it's reporting the thermostat is 71 degrees, which is getting from this. You can tell it's linked because it says radio link right there. Uh, I just need to install this out there. So what we're going to be doing is we're going to install these light switches. We're going to install little um, like door uh, sensors, um, motion detectors, and then it will allow us to automate various things here in the office. Now I'm doing an even more extensive uh, installation at my house. So this is just kind of a sneak peek for you guys. There, there are a lot of little gotchas and uh, things to the system, and I'll re reveal all when I do the review. But it's gonna, I need a couple weeks to really get used to it. So uh, that's the first look at it, and uh, you guys can get more information if you go to Lowe's website, just look up Iris. Okay, hope you guys have a great day. We will see you tomorrow. Don't forget, we got our live show at 3 p.m. Central, so we'll talk about all kinds of fun stuff from the week there. Bye for now.